guys, welcome to this video. You guys know Sam is an avid Timu purchaser. He purchases so many things every day on Timu, so I'm gonna show you some of them today. Um, a lot of them will be equestrian related. But first I'm gonna show you our tiny little kitten and how cute she is. She's like, hi guys, welcome to the family. <laughs> Isn't she so cute? She's getting like a totally different look about her now that she's growing. She's like, please pet me. This is her little bed and she loves it. <laughs> so the very first thing that I'm gonna show you is something I'm gonna start using right now. It's this little tube that he bought. It is for cutting wrapping paper. Christmas time, perfect time to try this out. So I'm gonna have Sam, I'm gonna have Sam show us how this thing works. So it holds your paper together. Usually I put tape and then you gotta try to take the tape off and stuff. But so it's supposed to hold your paper so it doesn't go missing. So instead of taping it so that yeah. your paper paper roll doesn't roll all over the place. Yeah, and then when you wanna cut it, you just measure what you want. Right? And then there's this little blade. Oh, I'm cutting it. And anyway, there you go, there you go. And you cut it. And then it cuts it. So I guess that's a thumbs up. How much was that? Should have bought another one. I think they were like a dollar fifty. Dollar fifty, and it cuts your that. paper. Cuts your paper. I follow him around the farm and show you guys all the equestrian things Sam has bought from Timu and how we like it. So, so I bought these from Timu. They come in a package of four. So these little rings that you can put your cross ties yeah. to. They come in a package of four. Package of four. They're about eleven dollars. Eleven dollars for four. And they come with screws, but I used uh, stronger screws. So they came with screws, but he used stronger screws. But they work awesome. We attach them with a breakaway rope. And they work great, work super great in our barn to hold our horses for the ferry. I bought each one of the horses, uh, these from Timu. Fly masks. Fly masks, and uh, they're about six to seven dollars each, depending. Yeah, they were seven dollars. Yeah, the only thing I don't like about it is they get too worn out and you gotta wash them so that they shrink up a bit again. They get a little bit, um, as they as the horses rub their face and... Yeah, this one is probably eaten by the dog. Uh, really? You let the dogs eat my... You know, something ate it. <laughs> Anyways, I love these. We have a variety of different kind of fly masks. We've tried all different kinds. We have way more than this in storage. Uh, we have these ones that we got at the, at the tax store. Um, we have this kind that we got at another tax store. We have a variety of different ones. These are the ones we bought off team with these. But those and you can ones. And them at the regular store, they're like $30. $30, and we got them for $7. Uh, love them. They were a perfection. So I think the fact that they get a little bit loose over time from the horses scratching and stuff, I think that's common with all fly masks that are made out of this kind of material. The eye sockets, phenomenal. They're so big. Other ones that we've used, other ones that we've used, I felt like the material rubs against their eye. Love those. So I think one of the very first things that he ever got from Timu were these shedding blades. And I think they were $7, weren't they? They were around anywhere between $8 to $10. These were between $8 to $10. They're way more expensive. How much were they on up in other places? Know, like $30. $30. And we got them for $7 or $8. These things work fantastic. They are my favorite shedding brush of all time. They have all different areas that you can use. You can use it on the side here to shed them, which works amazing. You can use this part to shed them. If there's a certain area that you want to scratch for the horse, you can use this area. Like these are phenomenal, way worth the discounted price. You guys know that when we moved here, we reset up this barn. We redesigned it. We made it completely different than when we first moved in. So we needed a bunch of things for around our barn. We bought these. These. And they're about five to six dollars each. And how much are they at the store? Uh, I think eight dollars at the store. All right, so not a, not a huge discount. I'll put the prices up on here as soon as I find them when we're making this video so you guys can see. But definitely a discount. They work the same. Are they the these same? These are plastic. These ones are plastic. Oh, but these are so metal. much better than the metal ones. They also have metal ones. I went to plastic because we broke some metal ones before. Yeah, the so plastic ones are good. They also sell the metal. So he also bought, are these ones from there too? Yeah, they're more expensive, but uh, 
they bend. But so, they bend, so they break. So they break. But actually, this is still stronger and better than the ones that we bought locally. They're exactly the same. Oh, they're the same? Yeah. How much? The ones that we have are in our tack room that we bought from the tack store. So how much are these? They're about $12, I think. $12 each? I think so, yeah. So another thing that we needed to change when we moved here was the lighting. And lighting can get so super expensive, but Sam went straight to Timu and he got lights. I don't know if you can see, I'll show a picture of them. They have six and then one in the middle. And about, so they have six lights and then one in the middle. They're about $24. $24. And depending where you go, they could be $54. That's yeah, around $60. That's what my friend said. They have them, $4. they bought them too. And so far we've had them for six months, about six yeah. months, and they're working excellent. We'll show you pictures. I don't know how much that one is. We'll show you this pictures. One. This is Timu and this is only a three. We bought all different kinds and I'll show you guys the pictures, but as you can see, our barn is very well lit up and at night it's it's so well lit up. We love it. So another thing that he bought that was actually super expensive was this scratch pad and it's for cows. I, I don't even like they it in here. horses too, but they, so I've seen where they put it around poles. It's bendable. Yeah. And I just put it there. I haven't seen the horses really use it yet. Cause it's like awful. It's like hard scratchy plastic and then we have another one over here what's this the same one, the same one? Yeah. oh ooh, it is i think, it comes in two, I think they're expensive these were expensive they're about 35 dollars but the thing with timu is if you don't get your order within the specified time you get a five dollar credit and then you can keep adding those up and then, so I, I can't remember but i think Sometimes when you leave stuff in your cart too, they give you a deal on it just so you buy it. And that's why I, I just throw things on my cart and I wait for the deal and then I buy yeah, it. Yeah, so these were a lot Even cheaper. Even though these were $35, I got them cheaper. Than yeah, that. and I think these are a, a risk, a Maybe hazard. Scratch my back. Okay, scratch your back on it. Let's see. Oh, scratch my butt. Scratch your butt on it. Does it hurt? Yeah, it hurts. <laughs> Go on. All right, so you know I'm always into buying trying out different cameras. I mean, we must have like, we have too many cameras on the property, but the ones we show you are the ones that aren't hidden. And this is one I got off of Timu. So he got this one to now, try it. This one again, I got is $35, um, but I got it on a deal. So it was less than that. And uh, I actually broke it. <laughs> so I haven't really tried it yet. I think I have to, Refix the power. This is a plug-in one, so it's not like a solar one like the other ones. I like a plug-in one though, because it... One, yeah, but the solar one works regardless if you have power or not. I haven't tried this yet, but I'll let you know if it works. <laughs> um, again, he uses these hooks that he got, the ones that were a package of four. We use them to lock gates, and we use them for cross ties. You can use these for anything, but we love them. So when you walk into our goat barn, it is very well lit up. Every single light in this barn is from Timu. I'd like to be able to get a better picture of it. And how much were they? I think they were like $7 each. Seven? Six, yeah, six, yeah seven. six or $7 each. And they work amazing. Uh, I've recently found that these ones are at the dollar store for $4. Oh, so that's bad. Dollarama, so that, that was a bad deal. Dollar store. He bought them before they were at the dollar store. So you guys saw that we got this. It's a goat carrier thing. It's to hang your goats. When we tried it recently, it we didn't we hadn't looked at the pictures of it, so we didn't put it on properly, so we didn't think that it worked, but it actually works really good. I'll show you a picture of how it's supposed to go. And we're gonna use this to cut goat's nails, weigh babies, especially to weight babies. Uh, so it's gonna come in super handy. It was from Timu. So something really exciting that I love that he bought that is important to us. It actually helps us keep watch of our goats and it's gonna come really, it's gonna come in handy a lot when they start giving birth. It's this little box right here. Yeah, it's what a is it? Wi-Fi repeater so it 
repeats the Wi-Fi signal from around from the house to the other barn. Do we uh, have one in the other barn too? In the other barn we do have one, but I didn't buy that off Timo. This one I bought off Timo for $18. $18? And how much is a Wi-Fi repeater? $18. How much is it regularly in another store? Oh, it can be like $50 and up. Wow. The other one for the other barn was $100. Wow. So, so you know what that does? It takes the Wi-Fi it takes the Wi-Fi from our house and puts Wi-Fi in the barns. So that is so important. $50. It extends the Wi-Fi out to the barn. Yeah, it extends our Wi-Fi from our house out to the barn. That was like $3. $3. Keep gate closed no matter what the goats say. You got that from Timu. I love these little signs. I want to get metal. more signs. Yeah, it's metal. You can put it out. It's crooked, <laughs> but super cute. This video isn't sponsored. We just decided to make it because some people have been asking us to share all the things that we've got from Timu because Sam is so addicted. So what I usually do though is if I see something I like, I check Timu first to see if it's cheaper. Because <laughs> nine times out of 10 it's cheaper there. So would you say- Unless I need it right away, then I go buy it. How long does it take for Timu stuff to come um, in? Usually with it, it used to be really quick, but now because they're really busy. It's Christmas time. And it's like two weeks usually it takes to get it. So, and the other thing I wanted to ask is, do you find the product superior or? It's exactly the same. Exactly the same. And that's what I find. Exactly the same. One thing you guys probably don't know about Sam is that he is a, the, a connoisseur of, of a deal. He loves a deal. And when he finds a deal, he buys a lot of stuff. Right. Cheaper yeah. the better. He has other websites that he uses that are similar, but for different kind of products. So if you guys want to see a video on that, let me know. But that is it. Those are our, so far, our equestrian purchases through Timu that we love all of them. Like, other than the camera he broke, they've all been the same as the regular price at the store. Right? Been cheaper than the store. Yeah, but the quality is the just quality as good. Is don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the